Hell, it's the Shalas. Hope everyone is doing well. Hope your day is going good. And the day is treating you right. So as you can see, we have $5,000. So I thought that today could be another building day. So we're going to, I've got all the lights on. And we're just going to go into building. And I think the first thing we're going to do is move this hedge out of the way. I mean... I think I need a little bit bigger kitchen. I think I want it to be a little wider. But most of all... Okay, let's move this over. Let's just move this back to there. We'll make this a little bit bigger. And we're going to scooch this out a little bit more. We're going to have a nice big bedroom. Okay. Actually, this can get scooted in one more, I think. I don't think we need this much room. Where to put this window then? I think we'll just put it there. Did anything go into my storage? Oh, we have this. I forgot about that. Right. Let's stick this in the corner there for right now. Yeah, I think so. And we'll go up here. And we shall grab some porches. And then we'll just copy it, put it out here. I don't think it needs to be that wide. It does need to be longer. There we go. And then let's just raise the whole house up. One, two, three. There we go. I think that works. Wait, let's move this. Move that over one. There we go. We'll start with that. We'll start with that. Oh, I moved it. I didn't copy it. Well. There we go. Actually, I think I do want this out a little bit more. Yeah. There we go. Like that. Okay. So we're going to need another door. There we go. And now I think we can put a desk. Well, that's fine. Let's put the desk here for right now, okay? This may be a little bit of a shorter stream today because I think the last one went like way too long. Way too long, to be honest with you. I always like this desk. $365, but you know what? I think we can do it. And then let's get a little comfy, cozy chair. And then let's just get a computer. We have a bookshelf, so I don't need that. Um, Maybe a little light for the desk. Oh, that's cute. Oh, those are really cute. Um... Not gonna lie, I kinda like this one. I think it looks adorable. Um now of course this is not in the center of the room anymore. There we go. Do I have enough? 
to get her. Oh. How did this get? Did we make it bigger? We must have made it bigger. Do I still have enough to get? Yes, I do. Let's sell this fridge and get a better fridge. Because that fridge is just not good. <laughs> I do not like it. I do like this one, though. Just get it in the in this color to match that yes and then let's get her a dishwasher so she doesn't have to keep washing them dishes man and we'll just get it in this color there we go so now she has a dishwasher so we don't really need quote unquote a kitchen sink well i mean i suppose she would if she was going to be We'll need to get moved over. This will get moved over. Um, definitely have that larger couch now. Move this over a little bit. We are going to need. Look at that. I'm down to $575. I better stop. We are going to need steps. Oh my gosh. I forgot about steps. Uh, just get these. No. And we're going to copy these, not. And I'm just rotating with my, uh, actually, I think I wanted, I'm rotating with my arrow keys or the, you know, there we go. Flooring options. I do like that one. I also like this one a lot. Let's see if we can't just do that. And shift key to do that. And then I think foundations are free, if I'm not mistaken. And I usually just go with like this one. I kind of do the lattice underneath the decks. Because that's what I'm used to. And then I just normally kind of go with like this. On the rest of the house. And it looks like we've used up most of our money. So, um, let's fix the roof. Oh no, build mode, please. Thank you. Because, uh, yeah, let's just, uh, let's, uh, oh, can I afford it? Probably not. Oh, I can because it's zero dollars. Nice. Okay. And then let's get a roof. We'll lower it a bit. And then we can copy it. Put it over here.
No, that looks absolutely terrible. Well, it'll look like that for right now. And then a little later on, it'll look better. I promise. When we get our next money, I have to remember to... um. We'll remember to uh, expand the house out a little bit this way. And when we do that, this roof will be bigger. And then that'll just be a little tiny roof over it. So we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Don't worry about it. We'll figure it out. And uh, I'll like build a ceiling and put a roof here and put some columns. But as you can see from our price tag right now, uh, we can't afford columns or a railing or anything, so it's just going to have to be how it is here. And then let's move this out to the front. And let's see, I think that's like the perfect size. Uh, top view, please. And we're just going to hit the Alt key to place it. And then we're going to um, copy it and size it down with the brackets and hit Alt to place it. There we go. Top view again. There we go. And we'll eventually have railings and... Fencing around there and fencing around the back. But for right now, this is what we got. So we're getting there. We're getting there. She's working at it. <laughs> All right. So as you can see, little miss here is researching this plant. But that's not what we're going to want her to do. First of all, we want to change her aspiration because she already did that. We are going to go into creativity and we're going to give her the author one. Really, I should have given her the musical genius one and just, you know, write two books while inspired. So we're going to Cloud Gaze. There we go. Now she's inspired. And then we're going to have her write, write a genre book, just write a kid's book. Uh, good night, good night, night light. A children's book. Hmm. I suppose that would be one you read to your children. Not one, um... We'll call this one Skills, Skills, Skills. Because we all know that's what needs to be done. They need the skills, skills, skills. <laughs> hey, Kibo. Uh, uh, uh. Do you want to go out on a date? Um, not right now, thanks. It's 9.30 in the morning. And I'm just a wee bit busy. Now, you can see her fun's not going down because I gave her liking writing. So she'll have fun while she does it. And then when you're done with that, you can go get some leftovers. And one thing I do really, really wish we had in The Sims 4 is the doorbells. That is one thing. It always drives me nuts that there's no doorbells in The Sims 4. Because it's like you have to constantly watch your door to see if you have visitors or not. Because you can't hear them knocking. And there's no doorbell. I mean, in The Sims 3, you'd hear that doorbell. Akira, you're at my door. Stop. I can invite you in, though. There, come on in. Aww. 
That was Akira kiss Akira. Okay, we're kissing him. Hello. You can come in too. Uh, we can kiss him. Why not? <laughs> oh my gosh, that was fabulous. I kiss Akira and Bella just claps for me. I love it. Oh my gosh, that was awesome. Akira is uncomfortable, and I'm not sure why. Oh. Bella's like, I hate the cemeteries. And I'm like, Bella's crazy. Look at that. Now Kira's embarrassed? He peed his pants. He's embarrassed. He must have done that before he came over here. He's going to go in the mirror. What was that? Embarrassed. Awkward encounter. Oh, we had an awkward conversation. Trapped inside from the outdoorsy lifestyle. Oh. Dear, you're just gonna have to deal with it. What are you doing? Now he's uncomfortable again. I don't know why. Oh, he's probably uncomfortable because he doesn't like my decor. Too bad. I'm almost done being embarrassed. Oh, look at the Ferris started. It's complaining about something. And she's like, but I love video games. Oh, no, she doesn't like, she's like, those dang kids with their video games. Why are, who's sad? Why are they always sad? Yeah, I'm going to cry it out. Oh, my gosh. Where is it? Call the Sadness Hotline, woman. And then self-publish a uh, new personality. Yeah, that's fine. She can be confident. Telling you, she's just having all kinds of issues, doesn't she? Look at this. She's carefree, waterproof, music lover, clumsy, loves the outdoors, self-assured. Quick learner, and I don't... Do I have any milestones? Let's look. I made a self-discovery. Social. I fell in love. Evidently. Those are my only ones. Okay, you can stop chatting now. Go publish your book. Come and sit here. I wanted to chat with Cassandra, but she's not here. Heartfelt compliment. Right in your day. See, he's uncomfortable. Because of my decor, I bet. But I don't care. I like my decor. I think it is cute. Uh, very annoying. Yeah, boy, 
And too bad if Akira doesn't like it. He will just have to live his life being uncomfortable. What are you going to do on the computer? Are you going to just look at it or what? You got to become inspired. Uh, it begins. Uh, yeah, you can like video gaming. I don't care. You got to go out here and you got to cloud gaze. You got to write two books while inspired, I think. Don't you? Uh, cloud gaze. There you go. Now go in here and write. Write a genre book. Write another children's book. Uh, what's this one going to be called? Children's book. The monster under your bed. Hey, it'd be a good, good book, right? Yes, I think so. Teach him how to befriend the monsters. Oh my gosh, Mortimer, what? Sorry to call out of the blue, but I had a dream about you last night. Oh, really, Mortimer? Really? We're in a field and there are these electric llamas. And they were sleeping. I'm not sure why they were electric, but you wouldn't let me wake the llama. <laughs> why wouldn't you let me wake the llama, Eve? Why? Explain why. Wow, I never thought of that. Dreams are so weird. <laughs> Some of these things are fabulous, aren't they? Yeah, it reached writing level three. Woot woot. I can now write a different genre of book, I bet. I can't believe we had enough to get porches. And a bigger room. And Akira's back. Why are you back, Akira? Oh, I have to pee. I'm going to use that as soon as I'm done writing the book. At 72 freaking dollars. And then I'm going to get some leftovers. And then I'm going to um, self-publish this. Yes, and we can go to sleep. And I'm going to turn this off. Oh, we need to auto-light the house again. There we go. What were you bored? Oh, from being inside. We gotta start making some money. And it is summer. Woo. So go use that. Uh, take a thoughtful shower. Uh, get some leftovers. What do you want to do? Listen to alternative music? And then listen to alternative music. There we go. And we'll have our cloud gaze again. We're going to turn that off. Wait, what does she want to do? Level up in writing skill. Let's see, this only lasts for two hours. And the other one, I think, lasts for four hours. Then I'm going to have her write. Write a short story. There you go. Yeah, see, that one lasts for six hours. So go write a short story. A uh, book of short stories. Peeking in the window. Because why not? 
a whole bunch of short stories about people that peek into windows. Sounds about right, don't it? And this will be the last book she writes today. Achieve level... Wait. Now I need to achieve level 4 in writing skill. Written for 15 hours. We got 9 out of 15 and write 5 good books. Oi. Hey, I reached writing level 4. I mean, the music one is nice and all, but you got to stop and think about it. You know, you can only do, like, one song per instrument per week. I know there's a mod that fixes that, but it's just kind of like... I'm going to self-publish. Wait, do I want it? Do I have... Am I able to publish yet? No. So self-publish that one. There we go. I finished an entire book. Look at that. All right. I think we should go collect some stuff real quick because we're not making any money from our writing yet. That is out of season. Isn't there usually a little rocky thing over here? I don't want to purchase seeds. Oh my gosh. There's like nothing here. Out of season, out of season, out of season. Everything is out of season. This is terrible. Harvest the bluebells, I guess. Oh, I should have made a greenhouse when I had the chance. <laughs> I really should have, huh? But I didn't, so we're just going to get what we can here. All right. We'll dig that up. There's some mushrooms there. Oh. Well, I do have some roses I could plant, but we better hope writing pans out. So what I'll do, guys, is I know sitting watching somebody writing books all day is um is pretty boring. So what I'm probably going to do is I will, um, no, Kira, I really don't want to go to your house and hang out. I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. What I'll do is I'll write a bunch of books offline. I'll, I'll, uh. I'll write a bunch of books offline for a few days and level up her writing skill and stuff to where I'm fine just um, having one book a day. Um, so we can have a more active thing because just sitting here watching me write books is not going to be all that entertaining for you. So... But I think we got quite a bit accomplished today. We got to visit with Bella and Kira. We had Bella applause for us kissing Akira. And uh, yeah, I want you to go here though. Go here. Yep. There we go. Stop. And I think we'll leave it for there um, for today. And like I said, I'll write a bunch of those books offline and um i won't do nothing else but write the books and then uh we'll join back in once she's got an income a decent income coming in more than uh let's see what did we make yesterday or this morning mm. 
you finished your first book. Royalty report. Or was it? There it is. Five twenty-five dollars. <laughs> We're gonna need a little bit more than that to sustain our income. So, um, but once she gets really good at writing and stuff, it won't be anything to write one book a day for her and keep her income up. So I think I will do that offline and and we'll end it for here today. But I do want to Thank you very much for choosing to spend your time with me today. I do really mean it. It means so much to me. It really does. And just remember to take care of yourself first, and then take care of your family, and then take care of each other. And I hope, as always, that you have a wonderful rest of your day. Goodbye.